Good morning, Vlogmas. I'm gonna do the waddle with me over here to the window. Okay, so it now looks very dark to me, but very bright to you, maybe? There we go. Mm -hmm. Okay, um, I got my hair cut. I was not thrilled with it when I left. Um, it looked very shaggy. I didn't want shaggy, I wanted it really smooth. But after sleeping on it, and then I got a shower this morning, so I kind of had like aeration, like spritzes. I didn't really wash it. I just let it get a little bit sprayed. And then I came out and blow dried it. And I think that's doing much better, much better. And you can kind of see the purple. It's so dark in there. I don't not understand. I have a level seven blonde under this. I feel like I should have electric hair by now. It's been years that I've been getting it dyed. Years. Why do I not have electric purple hair? <sighs> anyway, it's early-ish, um, eight something, nine, going on nine. Um, my husband decided this morning that he was going to reset all of our alarms to seven instead of eight. So I'm awake because I can't sleep through it. <laughs> um, it's Trina Day. I'm very excited. Uh, I also have some mythology to finish reading, which I've been putting off. And then what else? Just coffee, food, cleaning. I want to like vacuum. I lit a candle. It's got to be lovely. My arm's tired already. <sighs> there we go. Arm's tired already. Yeah, I'm gonna vacuum in here, try to get all that done. Um, I went with uh, comfortable yet lazy today. So I have joggers and my black tank top and just a little bit of flannel because now I know how fun flannels are. Um, and yeah, so I think, uh, I think coffee is gonna be first on the agenda dog went back to bed she's currently in our bed and um taking a nap waiting for patrick to come downstairs so um yeah since i'm not gonna feed her right now and i already disarmed the house so she can go out when she's ready i'm just gonna get started on some coffee because it's yeah it's about 8 30 so i'm gonna get started on coffee that's what i earned because I'm awake. <laughs> well, he's awake too, but he's on a call. Um, yeah. Happy Vlogmas Day 15. Uh, next few days might have more footage. Depending on how amenable Ina is to participating in Vlogmas. Um, we shall see. We shall see. So, yeah. All right. I'm going to log off here. And I will see you soon. Good morning, baby gypsy. Are you wearing a happy birthday bandana for my birthday week? Did you let everyone know that everything is 20% off on Etsy and Ravelry? Yeah? Tell everyone, go treat themselves if they wanted something. Because it's sales. Scritchy scritchies. You ready for admin cookies? Ooh, yeah. Look at that little nose go. Who's ready for advent cookies? <clears throat> advent cookies. Merry and bright. Yay! Let me go, let me go. Alright. Boop. I'm gonna go here. Let me get it. There it is. You got like little, you got sugar on your nose.
Good morning, Vlogmas Day 16. Um, so doorbell rings and our neighbor just gave us like rotisserie chicken, which is amazing. <laughs> it's so nice. And out there was this big box. And this big box <laughs> is from Tristan. And so there is a, uh, there is a, there's a, there's a box in here. There's two, there were two other things, but they were all individually wrapped. And I put the other two aside, um, until I figure out if they're bir birthday or Christmas. Um, but this says open on December 13th and it's the 16th. So I think that's fair game, right? <laughs> and then I was about to open it and I was like, oh, wait a minute, Vlogmas. Good morning, Vlogmas. All right, so wearing my old navy pajamas. Got my baby bump over here. <gasps> There's a box. Gypsy, what's in the box? What's in the box? Hi. <laughs> Hi. Ooh, getting real close. Okay, so. Oh, I'm so here for it. Oh my gosh. It's a sock a day. 12 days of socks, which is perfect because they're past 12 days of Christmas. So I will have socks till Christmas now. Oh, I'm so excited. Thank you, Tristan. I'm so excited. Good morning, Vlogmas. <clears throat> it is day 18, and I did so much talking last night. My throat is like bleh. <laughs> um, no, yesterday was my birthday. Uh, I have some pictures, but not video, and that is because I spent a majority of the day like cleaning, you know, so like everything was judged and vacuumed and trash out and all that, and I had help, but. I did take a lot of the day and then did hair and makeup and that took a little bit and um spent some time just sitting and talking and that was lovely so it just yeah i just did not get to vlog sorry i'm a little sorry for myself because i loved looking back at last year's vlog but i was by myself on my birthday which was less ideal and this time I had friends come over for pizza and snacks and the island's still a little bit of a mess and that's fine. But it was wonderful. 
it was really really wonderful and we had um gypsy's dog friends baxter and mushroom come over and that was wonderful <laughs> I love it when puppies come to party. So um, they were here and they did great. They they all play really well together, but they did great with everybody in the house. And Gypsy actually didn't freak out that much. There were so many people in the house. She's met most of them. Um, I think there were only two that were new to her. And when she kind of like lumped them in, we were all good. I am tired today. Bump and I are tired. I had to like late shower last night just because I was so achy from partying so much, of course. You have to party. So day two of 32 is recovery day. Um, I have my water already. My nails, I redid my nails. Look how fun they are. Yeah. Um, and I am just, yeah, I'm just, we're gonna watch some movies. We're gonna have some coffee. We're gonna do some knitting. I like had to hide most of my knitting uh, only because I wanted to make sure that the dogs didn't get into it because they, um, Gypsy does get curious when she wants to barter for things like pizza crust. So um, I had to like, you know, tuck, stash, do, you know, all the stuff, all the good stuff. Mm. I wanna get two squares on my blanket today and then I wanna knit on my inclination and, um, I think my friend Ashley asked me to crochet a star, but now I don't think she needs it. Can't really remember how that conversation ended. <sighs> um, there was mulled wine, which smelled incredible. Oh my gosh. Can't wait to try that again. <sighs> February is not too late for mulled wine, right? It's still cold. <laughs> so excited anyway i am very tired you can see i'm only losing it on the cup here i'm actually gonna make a little caffeinated coffee i think i'm gonna do birthday suit again that was very good actually hmm, candy cane though oh torn <clears throat> so i opened birthday suit from bones coffee um kind of like a vanilla-y cakey Went really well with French vanilla. Um, like, nothing earth shattering, but it was good. It was good. And then, and then I've got some of the smaller ones, the dork dorkanis. So like, like these little guys that I could brew up a pot of coffee, have it for the day, but it's caffeinated. So I have to, I have to watch how much I have, but, um, it would be, you know, like for, for Ina, still upstairs, might be still sleeping, that's fine. I am, I'm just gonna keep saying I'm so tired. <laughs> oh, today is the last day of my semester. I have to just make sure that I've commented on everybody's comments that I've needed to comment on. And then, um, finished. I had a lot of sign language in my dream last night. Whenever I think about my niece, Riley, who is um, deaf, I end up having dreams where I'm just, I'm talking and signing a lot. <laughs> and like, I'm not always sure I'm right up with the signs, you know, when you're dreaming. There's no one there to check you. <laughs> but, um... I'm usually like, I don't know if confidence is the right word, but maybe com yeah, like I feel like I'm usually doing just fine with just talking. I'm sorry, it's so wobbly. I am, I should put you down when I talk to you or use something to balance you a little bit more. Sorry, I'm very wonky. Um, I did the, I wonder if I could. I can, hold on. Okay, this works. I put you on my tripod that I normally podcast on, so at least you're still. Um, so the other day, I decided what I needed in the worst way was tiny sweaters. 
There are several excellent patterns. Um, Christy Houghton made one for the Star Wars book, so I have that. Um, but I was looking around and um, there's like tiny sweaters by like Stephen and Penelope. There's, um, God, I mean, there's, there's oodles, right? So I was like, but I've been very into doing ornamental things recently. What if I just tried a hand at making sweaters the way that I, I make sweaters, like adult sweaters, but teeny weeny, it does work. So this little guy was born. Boop, I just, how cute. I can't even. I want to sleep now. Oh my gosh, so early. It's not so early. <laughs> I just woke up. Um, it's so cute. I'm working on an itty bitty sleeve now. And I'm making adjustments to the pattern as I go. But now I've got, like, I went through and I just picked up, like, all yarns that I thought would make good ornaments. I'm like, I don't need more things to do. I need less things to do. And I need more cleaning done. And instead, what I've been doing is, like, making tiny sweaters. <laughs> I debated... So my charts actually would work on this. I know. Um, my charts would work across the belly and I'm t tempted to have two different sizes that would go with um, the second and third size charts of my pattern, which would also work with the, um, the first size chart. So be first and third would work and the fourth would work. But oh my goodness. So this yarn is by Molly of a Homespun House. She gifted it to me probably around wedding Christmas. So it would have been like 2016, 2017, somewhere around there. And um, yeah, and I just knit it up. Um, I do love how they're kind of like little swatches. Uh, so if you were like trying to test a color or use up some of your minis, I think they're great. Um, they're really nice for yarns that you don't want to get beat up, you know, like not a, not a toy toy. Uh, this would go on the tree. I was debating putting a letter on it for each member of the family. I thought about doing that. thought about testing out like a duplicate stitch of a chart. Um... But yeah, so that's just been like mulling. Can tell me what you think. Um, I think the sleeves need to be a little bit thicker. I think two stitches thicker for the sleeves. But I just, I'm just, yeah. So I didn't get to work on inclination or my cozy memories because as Trina was on a, like a, a video conference or something, I is down here like, I need to make tiny sweaters. I don't know if it's Christmas. I don't know if it's the end of the semester. I don't know if it's the fact that I'm about to have no homework and I'm like, oh, I can knit all day, which I need to watch because I am at risk for carpal tunnel. <laughs> Sorry, there's, that wasn't a quotation. I'm at risk for carpal tunnel and I shouldn't get too crazy. Um, but, okay, I can't even, I can't even, I need this tiny sweater. So um, I'm thinking I'm gonna start with this one. And then, uh, so like I'll have one, I think this might be, I might do a letter for mom. And then I found another strand that I think is Tristan's yarn. Might be Gabby's, but it's beautiful brown. And I just thought it would be so gorgeous. So I, I pulled this one out. I wanted to make this color for Gypsy. It's part of the Wonder Woman mini set that I had. And then um, this one for me, look how cute that is. Look at that red. And then um, I thought this green for Patrick, but 
He's like, you won't see it on the tree. Well, okay, <laughs> touche. So now I'm kind of back to the drawing board with his, he did like, I had all set up, I'm missing a DPN. Somewhere in the kerfuffle of knitting all those planets, lost the DPN. But I really like the orange on this and the, uh, the mini here, so. I think this is Sea Monster, which was our fourth, third wedding anniversary color. He gave me this skein. And um, I actually made a little baby hat out of some yarn that I had knit for something for him previously out for our fifth anniversary color. So it's nice. I like kind of like doing small things that I can look back and be like, oh, that was our, our first or second or third or fourth anniversary. But yeah, so I really like this orange, which I agree would be gorgeous. So just trying to keep things together. But like the goal was to clean for the party, not get out more things. So I'm just saying it's, uh, it's time. It's been well, maybe 15 minutes. So I'm just gonna get some coffee going and then I'm gonna cuddle in and wait for everybody else to get up and be really happy just knitting tiny sweaters. Oh, I also pulled, so this was my favorite blue, um, which might be Patrick's actually. So this was my favorite blue from my sweater. The kind of like, an, was it a no frills? Mm-mm. Cozy Classic Light by Jessie May. I did it fingering weight, held single. I didn't do mohair and I did it in this color. And I always get a lot of compliments on that sweater because it's great color. And I love this color on me. I think it looks fab. So um, I think a tiny sweater in this would be adorable. So now I just have this, like I'm trying to control the bag. I'm trying to control the scraps. I just think that this would be so good. Diddy deep. And I still have some socks for baby that are here that I need to finish. Um, baby socks do not take long and I've just not been doing them because inclination took my heart and the cozy memories. I really want to take to the hospital and snuggle under with the baby. So like, I think I need like 12 more squares and if I work on that like if I just worked on my cozy memories today I could get like three or four done and I'd be smooth sailing but I kind of want to do a little bit of everything I think that's what I'm gonna do I'm doing like the belly shelf you just hold it here but yeah I am gonna finish this though so that it's no longer a whip because that's ridiculous so I'll, I'll finish this and I'll start some squares and finish some squares and then We'll be all good. All right, coffee time. Cheers. This is what it means when I say I love bonus coffee. And I have a lot of it. So these are mostly, some are opened, some are not. Um, some I just have like the, the littlest like shot to finish off. But I'm, I'm looking, yes, right. So this is today's. 